Much needed help is on the way to a local hospital overwhelmed by the onslaught of COVID patients. And WJN's Dana Revick live from Harvey with more on this tonight. Dana. Well, there are currently 71 patients being treated here at uh, UChicago Medicine's Ingle Memorial Hospital. And as you can imagine, staff here have been stretched thin. So there is now a federal team of doctors, nurses, and other support staff here on site to help with this surge. It was a chaos. And chaos is an understatement. Feroz Vorha recently brought his father-in-law to the emergency room at U Chicago Medicine Ingalls Memorial Hospital in Harvey after he was having leg weakness and unable to walk. They got there around 8 p.m. and waited all night. 5, 6, 7 a.m., 8 a.m. Nothing is moving. It took nearly 15 hours for him to be seen by a doctor, and that's not the worst it's been. A friend sending Vora this flyer posted in the ER on New Year's Eve showing a 40 plus hour wait. The nurses at the ER hugged my wife and cried. The nurses are going through a lot, you know, especially the emergency room, the nurse and the doctors. We know that the most critical need right now is medical staffing for our hospitals. The head of FEMA addressing this issue last week. And we've been working nonstop with the Departments of Defense and Health and Human Services who have been on the grounds in communities since day one to push even more medical teams out the door to communities who need it most. Today, Governor J.B. Pritzker announced the approval of a federal national disaster medical system team. 26 physicians, nurses, and other specialists will be deployed to support Ingalls Memorial for 14 days, reducing strain on the hospital and providing frontline caregivers to relieve internal teams who have been fighting the pandemic for nearly two years. It's great. As a city of Harvey, we are underserved community. We need any and all help we can get. So as a resident of Harvey, we applaud the federal government and Governor Pritzker to take care of Harvey. Now, one of that man's daughters, also a nurse here, she has passed along to him that a typical nurse to patient ratio is one nurse to four patients. She tells him that she has been taking care of double that, eight patients on average recently, and that many days she can't even take a lunch break. Uh, so these teams, again, are on site now for the next 14 days. Uh, residents wish that they could stay longer, but they are hoping that this provides some relief to the staff. Live in Harvey, Dana Rebic, WGN News.